Hey guys, so I am just drinking my tea this morning and I am just getting my day started, trying to go ahead and start doing some stuff that I would need to get done. I have a Zoom meeting this morning and then of course I have work this afternoon and so that's fun. I am so ready to be at work. I'm like, honestly, like last week I did not have work at all because we were closed for pretty much the whole week and I was like bored, so bored. I like just when, when you get so used to working, you find that like going back to not working at all is just like the most boring thing ever and you kind of just feel like, what are you doing with your life? And so I actually like really missed working, but it was just because like most of my friends are also still in school, um, you know, at least the ones who like live around here. And so it was like, you know, I was bored and then like my boyfriend was working. So it was like, <laughs> I didn't know what to do with myself. I just used it at the time to either catch up on sleep, you know, chill out. Also, like, watch some adult shows because I do find that working with the younger generations makes it so that you tend to, like, feel like a kid yourself. So, it made it so I chose to, like, take some time for myself and watch, like, shows that are for adults. So, I am just drinking my tea. And I'm also working on my crockpot meal. I've been really trying to get into crockpot meals because I'm finding that like some weeks I'm really having a hard time just even wanting to cook at all. So I am super excited to finally be doing that. And so I will see you guys later when I show you what I'm having for breakfast. And I will show you like a preview of like the before dinner thing before it actually is ready it I don't know if it's gonna be ready before I go to work it probably will be because I'm trying to just go ahead and get it started because I know that when I get home I'm not gonna want to work on it and I'd ra rather it be like ready to go so we're gonna do that all right so here is my smoothie doesn't look very pretty, but I put some spinach in it, so that's why it looks all green. And then I just did some frozen fruit in there, and some chia seeds, and a couple of dates to kind of try to sweeten it a little bit. And then, of course, some almond milk. I don't know why, but Walmart doesn't carry oat milk, unless it's just a Walmart where I live. Um, so I just usually get almond milk because I am not a big fan of um soy milk unless I just use it in like recipes but like when I'm drinking it not a fan so this is breakfast and then I will be um having an early lunch because I go to work at 12 and so this is what my dinner looks like right now it just has some black beans in it some chickpeas and some diced tomatoes and all sorts of spices some cumin and honestly it was just kind of something that my boyfriend helped me throw together like I was just like wanting to try to figure out how to use up some black beans because I had two cans of black beans and I was just really trying to figure out how to work on using those up so this is kind of what I've got so far, I still have like one more spice to throw in and then I'm going to start working on cooking it. And so that's that, but that's what it is. Yeah. So I did, um, leave what is left of the better than bovine. That is what I used instead of using the, um, broth that I brought. But it was just because the bolin is getting pretty old. So I really like, and even though it's not expired yet, I just really wanted to go ahead and start working on using that. And I figured like this would be the perfect recipe to use that on. So I um, 
still have some leftover of it and I don't want to throw it away yet just because you know obviously it looks really chunky right now and like I mean it hasn't even started cooking yet so I'm just going to wait and see like how chunky it gets and if it's too chunky for me I'm going to throw some more of it in there just to kind of help like you know get it a little bit more liquidy so I will have to put it on low for while I'm at work so that is what I'm making it's like almost like a mixture between chili and taco soup I guess but I just like didn't really want to buy meatless meat because meatless meat can be like pretty expensive sometimes so I've been really trying to figure out ways to get around that I have to hurry up and go ahead and get ready to head to work but I kind of forgot to take a picture of what I was eating because I ran a little over the meeting that I had but I just wanted to show you that I had some just egg with some spinach and then I found this like follow your heart guada cheese and it was the only cheese that I could find there was no like chow cheese which is what I normally buy and so I decided to just like mix that together with the just egg and I just ate that I'm like honestly like not hungry but it also is only 11 something and I had that like huge smoothie so I am just gonna like have that like egg to kind of like help hold me over um and then I will um called it egg but it's not really egg but okay and so I'm going to do that and now it's time to go to work and I will see you guys later hey guys so here is what the final look of the soup is it's kind of like a chili slash taco soup look it is actually very yummy. I wasn't sure how it was going to taste. And it's very good. So I am very much enjoying this. And I'm not sure whether I'll eat anything else tonight. I'm like so hungry. I'm actually really surprised I'm so hungry tonight. But I am going to enjoy this. And then I may or may not eat anything else tonight. I don't know. But hope you guys are doing well. And... If you like this video, give it a thumbs up or a comment, and I will talk to you guys later.